hi and welcome to my channel so today I'm going to be showing you how I make my baby's food um, my baby is six months old right now so he has started eating some solid foods and this one is one of them this was um, recommended to him by his pediatrician so the recipe is very simple and easy to make my baby has been eating this this is actually the third time i'm going to be making this for him and so far so good he has been loving it like whenever i make it he will finish everything so i thought why not share it with you guys maybe your baby might like it or love it so um, i'm just going to be walking you through the ingredients these are just the ingredients or the items you need for this recipe so here I'm going to be using some parsley I'm not going to be using all of them I'm just going to break it from here and I will use only this I will show you that later in this video I'm also going to be using some cheese just grated cheese I'm going to be using some ground turkey this is specially made for kids so i'm going to be using only one bottle and let's keep this one aside i'm going to be using two medium size um, irish potatoes two carrots one zucchini as you can see it's not too big it's not too small it's just medium size just one of this you will need some olive oil just olive oil not vegetable oil olive oil extra virgin olive oil as you can see finally you will be needing some water and um, this is about 500 ml of water yeah that's all you need for this recipe so what i'm going to do next i'm just going to wash all the vegetables and the potatoes and then I'll come back and show you what next to do so guys I'm done with washing all the vegetables and the potatoes as you can see and another thing I want to say is before you start making your baby food make sure you wash your hand properly and like I said before make sure you wash the vegetables properly as well so as you can see my hands are very nice and clean so I'm just going to be peeling the back of the of these potatoes and this is the parsley I told you about I was going to cut it from here so this is the one I'm going to be using and I'm not going to be needing this one So I'm just going to cut it into smaller pieces so that it will be easier to cook. So as you can see by the side I have some water so what I'm going to do is when I'm done cutting the potatoes I will use the water to wash it one more time because we don't want to introduce that into our baby's system you know they are still very tender so I'm just going to wash it and add it into a clean pot and then I will pour in the 500 ml of water, cover the pot and I'll allow it to cook for about one minute just to let it boil a little bit. And while the potatoes are boiling, I'm just going to continue with cutting the rest of the vegetables. So once it starts boiling like this, you can then go ahead and add the vegetables. So one thing I forgot to mention when I was introducing the, the ingredients, you don't need to add any salt to this. No pepper, no spices at all. Just what I showed you and the taste will come out so amazing. So after adding it, 
you cover it and let it cook until they are very soft. So guys, let's check on the vegetables and potatoes. As you can see, they are now soft. So I'm just going to add the rest of the ingredients. Alright, now I'm going to add the ground turkey. And then I'll add 2 tablespoons of the grated cheese. Finally, I'll add the extra virgin olive oil and I'm adding 2 tablespoons. So I'm going to stir everything together so that it's evenly combined just gently stir it around like I said before make sure you don't add any salt or pepper to this food all right turn off the heat and then let's move over to the blending part So I'm just going to be blending everything in a blender. If you have a hand blender, you can use a hand blender to make it easier for you. I have it, but mine is not uh, working as I want. So I'm just going to pour everything into this blender. So once you add everything into the blender, blend it until it's very smooth and creamy as you will see right now. So after blending it, this is what it should look like and this is the consistency you should be aiming at. I don't know if you can see it clearly. Yeah. So I'm going to be adding it into this um, little container so one thing I want to say again um, when I pour this into the container I give it to him once sometimes twice a day depending on so and I make sure that it doesn't last more than three to four days in my fridge so you want to make sure that he finishes it in the next three to four days so if this is the first time your baby will be eating it, um, he might not like it the first time you are giving it to him, but try and force him a little bit, he will start eating it. So that was what happened in my own case. So I'm just going to pour it into this container. Can you see the consistency? This is exactly what you should be aiming at. You don't want it to be very thick and you don't want it to shock your baby in the truth so this is for one seven you can finish this one at once can you see that yeah and when you are done cooking it you should test it if it tastes like avocado then you know that you got it right because that's exactly how it tastes like <laughs> i can't get over the taste it tastes so delicious and so good just exactly like avocado you can store it in your fridge and let it last for three days three days is enough anything more than three to four days you should pour it away okay so please do try this recipe and let me know how it turned out and let me know how your baby enjoyed it because I'm very sure your baby is going to love it. I'm going to show you how I feed my baby with this. And yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please, please, please make sure you try this recipe. It's so good, so nourishing, so delicious, so nutritious, so healthy for your baby. So... Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Bye. 
so guys this is my baby eating and enjoying the food as you can see and another thing I want to say is the first time you give this to your baby it's normal if he vomits because this is the first time you are introducing a new food into his body or into his system so if he vomits it's okay just don't give up continue giving it to him or her and I assure you that once you try it once or twice he will start loving it so yeah that was what happened in my own case the day I gave it to him for the first time actually he was eating it he was enjoying it but at a point he started vomiting so I was like oh yeah that's normal because it's just the first time he is tasting such things so don't panic if your baby starts vomiting so I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do please be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already thank you so much for watching I will see you guys in my next video